Hello, this is Mr. Collier, and today we're doing the integral of cosecant x secant squared x. Okay, so to handle this integral, we can use a trig identity. Uh, we can say this is equal to cosecant x times 1 plus tan squared x. Okay, once we do that, we get something that we can integrate. We've got cosecant x plus cosecant x tan squared x uh, dx, okay? So the integral of cosecant x I handled in a previous video. That's simply uh, ln absolute value of cosecant x plus tan x. And to handle this integral here, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change these into sines and cosines and see what happens. Cosecant is 1 over sine x, and this is going to be sine squared x over cosine squared x. Okay, so this becomes, well, some signs are going to cancel, and I'm going to rewrite it like this. It's going to be sine x over cosine x times 1 over cosine x dx. And then that is going to be tan x and uh, secant x. Okay, so notice that that is simply the derivative of secant x. So this is equal to secant x plus the constant. So the entire integral is equal to the uh, the negative ln of cosecant x plus tan x plus this. 